guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Stacy, creator at Mother Naked, and I make videos about selling candles, candle making, and making money from home. Before we start, I just want to talk about a giveaway that I'm doing. If you win, you can get two free candles, a room spray, a diffuser, and a box of wax melts. The whole gift box is worth about £54, so uh, I would enter it. <laughs> To be able to take part, you must be based in the UK. I know it's a bummer. I'm sorry for my other viewers. It's just because my products have natural ingredients in them, uh, especially the diffuser and the room spray, and it'll take like five to six weeks to get to you, and I don't know what condition the product's gonna be in at that point. They'll be stuck at customs and warm, and it's just, I'm not gonna do that. So uh, I'm sorry at the minute uh, with the shipping time being what it is, uh, because of coronavirus, uh, I'm only going to base this one in the UK. To be able to enter, you follow me on Instagram, subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit myself, and thirdly, go on my website at www.mothernakedcandles.com. At the bottom of the website, you will see mailing list submit button. Put your email in there, uh, and then you're done. You are in the competition. It will be ending on the 4th of September, I want to say. Uh, so yeah, we're only doing this competition for four weeks. I like short ones, uh, just before Christmas as well. So get yourself entered, you might win it. So today, what we're doing? Uh, I'm going to show you how I package my candles for shipping and how I ship my candles. Okay, so at the minute, the way people are shopping on my store, uh, I only use two boxes. I had had like five different choices of box because I just didn't know what to expect when people were buying the products. But most of the time we're using a rectangular box like this, boop, or a smaller box just for a candle or two candles. Uh, and that seems to be what I'm selling right now. And you just go dirt, 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 push that down. That clips onto there, and that clips onto there. How easy is that? And that's our gift box style box. Now I take some of our stuff in. Again, I will list it below where I got everything from. And I just like to spread it out. Not too much though, because we are going to pack it in when we've got our products in. So just like a nice kind of amount on the base of our box. Okay, so let's pretend our customer has bought a room spray. So we'll put that in. I like to put it as near to the side, but still looking nice. Um, then people usually buy a candle. Uh, and I'm lucky enough to have found out that these are our normal wax melt tubs. These are 12 ounce. Um, what I did was I got eight ounce as well, uh, thinking that I could just put a couple of wax melts in. Better. Our candles actually fit in <laughs> the eight ounce tub so now they couldn't be more protected if I tried so we put that there and maybe they bought a diffuser as well so we put that in there reed sticks in there and that's the box done Basically, you're not trying to cover everything. You're just trying to make it not be able to move as much. We take our bag, our Mother Naked bag, and I just kind of put it on top. And that just kind of softens the blow of everything, really, and keeps everything together. And that's it. So that's when they open the box and then we put our box down and it just slides in like this. I love these boxes, so easy. That's not really going anywhere. So I'm quite happy with that. And we just take our box. And what I use for this is basically string, white, and 100% recycled plastic tape and then we've got some double sided tape and take the recycler tape and put it on there so it's, that isn't going anywhere turn it around and 
And now I need to seal this bit, but I don't want any nasty tape showing. Come to stick it. It just looks lovely. And there's no nasty bits or anything like that on it. Do the same with the corners. scraggly bits want it as much as possible fasten that turn it up and there we are there is our lovely gift wrap wrapped box start with the top tie it around then we just take our little leaf and tie it around these ones are pet plastic, so they can actually go in your recyclable bin, but we've got some paper ones coming, which I'm like hard paper ones coming, so that'll be better. Okay. Jobs are good, isn't it? What I like to do is put one of our stickers on and then put the shipping label here. Okay, so now it's time for the shipping part. I like to use, for my shipping labels uh, on the products, I like to use this just normal label paper. Uh, you can get this from Amazon. It's got a yellow back and then that's your label and it just peels off. Uh, you can print on it. So I print our shipping labels on here, cut it out and then stick it on our gift box. Now for shipping, I use a courier service because it's so much easier. Uh, it makes, you can get parcels out quicker as well. The majority of the time, people want standard shipping. I've got three shipping uh, options on my website now. Before it was just standard shipping. Now I've come up in the world and we've got three different options for shipping. Two are with the courier Hermes, uh, standard shipping, and then there's a three to four business day shipping that's a little bit cheaper. And then for next day delivery, which is also an option, I either use DHL or Parcel Force to deliver next day parcels. And how you do that, if you go on their website, you will see a form, basically, where you've got a slot saying how much does your parcel weigh. Uh, usually mine are either one to two kilograms or if they've just packed a candle, it's below a kilogram. Uh, and this is just for Hermes, by the way, that I'm talking about. So. Uh, we use a form, uh, you fill in your postcode, customer's postcode, the weight of your parcel and then it will take you to what's in your parcel. You just put candles or fragrance products or whatever. You choose your customer's address, add your address as the return sender. You choose whether you want it signed for, which I think is 90p. And then you choose either you're going to drop it off yourself, which is free, or you do what I do and use a courier, which is 72p. Then it'll either take you to a part where you can pay by card or PayPal, pay for it. And then they will give you a label saying print me out, basically. It comes with two massive labels uh, on a sheet of paper. I can't show you because I've only got customers' uh, forms. But it gives you two basic forms. One that you cut out and stick on your box. I like to stick it here. It just basically says your customer's address, how much it weighs, uh, etc. And some information for Hermes. Uh, I stick it there and then the other part of it goes in your actual box. So normally I would have done that first, click that out and then again with invoice, uh, I always print out an invoice for people so that they can see the cost breakdown and things. And I always put a thank you card in there as well. So there's just a few extras that go in there uh, that I like to do right at the beginning. Uh, and that's it. Oh, I also like, usually it's all fragile stuff that I'm using. And what I like to put just below the sticker is a Fragile. You can get the ones off Amazon, you know, like the red and white ones, but aesthetically with the box, I just don't want that on my box. So I just use a white and black uh, Fragile sticker that I print out. Get your shipping label and we're done. That is how I ship my candle parcels. Usually I can do it with Hermes so that if someone orders on Wednesday, they will pick it up Thursday. So then I just have a, a kind of a spot in my hallway where I can just put parcels on the table, ready for Hermes's pickup. And that's it, it's really simple. Kind of panicking about getting to the drop off or whatever. Um, yeah, the courier just comes and collects it. And, and that's it, easy peasy lemon squeezy.
So I hope this video has helped you out a little bit either with either how I package my gift box and how I send my parcels out to you guys. So uh, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to take part in the giveaway. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you liked it. Thank you.